Good morning, St. Thomas More. Today we will, we will be officially voting in our student council for the 2021-2022 school year. Typically, this is done in May, but given the fact that we were learning remotely, we could not do a good enough job holding an election remotely. We will be hearing speeches from candidates running for social convener, grade 12 representative, grade 10 representative, and grade nine representative. But first I would like to introduce our, well, you already know her, but Bianca Esposto is this year's student council president. And now we have the following executive positions that have been acclaimed. Our vice president for this year is Josiah Bowen. Our spiritual rep is Giselle Palakumar. Our treasurer is Angelica Guidetta. Our technology reps are Alessia Agro and Tiana Paradisi. Congratulations to your new positions on student council. So, next we will begin with hearing from our grade nine representatives. The grade nines will represent, or sorry, our grade nine candidates are wanting to represent the voice of their grade level peers. Today we will hear from Stella Amoa, Sophia Bianchi, Melania Bozzo, Julia Gower, Remus Hamuda, and Addison Rodriguez. Hey STM Knights, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. My name is Stella Ma and I'm running for the grade nine rep position. This year has started off on a good note, especially now that we can do sports teams, clubs, and most importantly, get involved. That's one of the main reasons I'm here right now. I love being involved with my community and helping out in any way that I can. So hearing about this amazing opportunity, I just couldn't give it up. SCM deserves a grade nine rep that is trustworthy, responsible, and reliable, and has many more. Trusting in someone isn't something you do overnight. To trust someone, you have to prove that they're trustworthy and trust promises made will be kept. If you vote for me, I will 100% make sure that trust will be gained with our grade nine students. Also, I want people to be comfortable coming over to speak to me when needed. I'm a really outgoing person and easy person to talk to. So if you had any concerns or suggestions, that, that wouldn't be a problem. Also, I don't want people to vote for me just because they know me or they're my friend. I want people to vote for me because they truly believe I'll make a good nine, grade nine representative for this year and do wonderful things for us in the near future. Basically, to sum it all up, if you vote for me, I will try my hardest to make it the sweetest grade nine year, and that's a promise. Hello and good, hello and good morning, St. Thomas More. My name is Sophia Bianchi, and I'm running for grade nine representative of this year's student council. I realize that most of you probably have no idea who I am, so I wanted to start off with some stuff about yours truly, me. I was president of my elementary school's grade nine of my elementary school student council last year, I do competitive dance and I have two cats. But let's move on. When I was writing this speech, I had to ask myself, what even is a grade nine representative? Thankfully, it is self-explanatory. As grade nine representative, I will represent the ninth graders of this school, believe it or not. Some of my jobs will include voicing the concerns of any fellow ninth graders, helping to plan events, contributing my ideas, and helping to make this school year as fun as possible. My main priority, if you elect me, will be to boost school spirit. I hope that everyone shows up to sports games, school dances, and gets involved in school activities. Even just reaching out to make new friends. I want the school community to feel safe and happy, and increasing school spirit is a great way to do that. I hope each and every one of you feels welcome when you walk in the school building. I consider myself a qualified person for this position. I have not one, but two years of student council experience, and I'm a very approachable person. So if you ever have a question, comment, or concern, you can feel free to talk to me about it. I also have lots of ideas and I am so excited to become a more active member of the school community in student council or not. I will do whatever it takes to help make this school year a fabulous one. Even though you hardly know me, I'm asking you to take a chance on me by electing me as your grade nine representative and I will not let you down. So when you make your vote, remember the name Sophia Bianchi. Thankfully, it's very easy to remember. Sophia is a very common name. Every other Gen Z girl's name Sophia, and Bianchi rhymes with donkey. So vote Sophia Bianchi. <laughs> That's all I have, so thanks for listening, and best of luck to the other candidates. Hey, STM. My name is Melania Bozzo, and I'm running for the position to be your grade nine representative. Now this isn't about me, it's about you and as your representative I will ensure that you have the best year possible. My job is to be an advocate for you. I want your voices to be heard and your ideas to be executed. 
for example, grade nine dance, school trips, clubs to participate in, and more. After a long and hard past year, I want us to get back to normal and I want to be the one to help us all get there. I want your first year at St. Thomas More to be the perfect beginning to your high school experience. I'm asking for your vote to be grade nine rep because I want to make a difference and I want us all to build memories that we'll cherish and remember forever. Now remember to vote Melania Boza for grade nine rep. Thanks, STM. Good morning, St. Thomas More. My name is Julia Gower. I'm a grade nine student here and I stand before you today as a candidate for the student council grade nine class representative. First off, I would like to tell you a little bit about me. I am coming from Regina Mundy Catholic Elementary School where I represented the school community as grade six class rep, vice president of the student council in grade seven, and president of the student council in grade eight, as well as a valid Victorian for the grade eight graduating class of 2021. While being a part of the school council, I had the opportunity to plan and organize several fundraisers and events such as Halloween dances, Christmas raffles, and several activity days. I love school, especially math and English classes. I'm ambitious, outgoing, and reliable, and like to think that I'm pretty funny, but I'll let you be the judge of that. I want to be grade nine rep on the student council because I want to be a voice for grade nines, support the school community, and most importantly, make this year fun for you. After a few challenging years of navigating through school virtually and experiencing school distantly, I look forward to making school as fun and as safe as possible and get back to having a normal year, both inside and out of school. I want to be involved in the school community to make it the best it can be. Although I am new to the school, I am proud to be a student at St. Thomas More and hope you will consider me to represent our class. If I were to be elected as grade nine representative, I will do my absolute best to bring forward and address any issues, concerns, or ideas on behalf of our class to make our grade nine year the best it can be. I will answer any questions that you may have about the school community as we are all new to the school and still have lots to learn. Remember, we are all in this together. Again, my name is Julia Gower and I hope you will vote for me as your grade nine class representative. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to a new chapter of your lives. We can finally say we've left the nest and are starting to navigate life all on our own. Well, maybe just with a little bit of guidance. My name is Ramas Hamuda and I'm running to be your grade nine rep. As we know, these last 18 months have been wild. With COVID, we've been in and out of lockdowns, had to uh, be accustomed to wearing masks and can't even hang out properly with our friends. Heck, we didn't even have a proper graduation coming out of grade eight. But we can't let all of that get in the way of us enjoying this new school year. As your grade nine rep, I'll be there to support your mental well-being, ensure we make long lasting memories and have the best year possible. How, you may ask? Well, for starters, I'm confident in my skills and abilities as I consistently give my all to everything I do. I'm also very creative, open-minded, understanding, and responsible. I strive to be the best version of myself at all times. Not to mention, I would always be there for you. So if you ever needed a buddy to hang out with or even just had a question or concern, I'd be there. I'm someone who you can rely on and I would love to be your voice to communicate your thoughts and opinions to the student council. Needless to say, I'll make this year very memorable and the best out of all of our high school years. Although we might be missing out on our typical high school experience, that doesn't mean we have to let that get in the way of enjoying what we already have. And alas, don't forget to vote for a mass. Thank you all so much for listening. Good morning, grade nines. My name is Addie Rodriguez, and I'm running for your grade nine student council representative. I have four years of student council experience, and I think I'd be a great fit for one of this year's grade nine reps. I have two siblings and I'm an older sister, which means that I'm a great listener and I'm always ready to hear about people's issues. If I'm elected, I will never be too busy to talk with you about your problems or concerns. I work very hard to get good grades, but I also know that high school is a time to have fun and make amazing memories. I'm prepared to do whatever it takes to make this the best grade nine year for all of us. I may not be the tallest, the most talented, or the most athletic, but I'm very hardworking and I will always do my best. If you elect me, my job is to be your voice in the student council, and I promise you that I will do that job to the best of my ability. I know that the past 18 months have been unbelievably different for all of us, and our first, grade night, and our first year of high school has not really been what any of us could have expected, but luckily, we get to be here together right now. If you vote Addy Rodriguez for your grade nine student council representative, you'll be guaranteeing yourself a better year. 
Don't be a saddie, vote for Addie. Thank you, grade nine candidates. Next, we will hear from our representatives, or sorry, our candidates running for grade 10 representative. The role of grade 10 rep, once again, is to be the student voice of, the grade, of their grade level peers. So today we will hear from Madeline Inoue, Gabriella Miklavik, and Alicia Perry. Hey, STM. As some of you may know, I'm Madeline Inoue. And if you don't know me, hi, I'm Madeline Inoue, but you can call me Maddie. You may know me from tripping in front of you, that one TikTok, or alternately one of your classes. Like many of you, I got thrown into na grade nine with few friends and basically no classes with the friends I did have amidst the global pandemic. During this, we all lost experiences in school that are very important to us, whether it be school, sp sports, or theater. For me, I lost band. If you've known me for a while, you may know music is something I'm really passionate about as it helps me de express myself and de-stress. Another thing I was passionate about in elementary school was student council. Though we didn't, didn't officially have one, a group of friends and I did take it upon ourselves to plan spirit days and dances, which I personally really enjoyed doing. Which brings me to today, running for your grade 10 representative. Now you may, may be wondering, why should I care who representative is? Or what would you do for me as representative? Well, a representative's role is to listen to other people in their grade's suggestions and communicate them to the rest of the council members to hopefully bring change within the school. As a grade 10 representative, I try my best to be available to hear your ideas, whether it be at lunch or in the halls, to make this year the best year possible. Thank you for listening, and remember to vote round and anyway for your grade 10 rep. Good morning, STM, students, teachers, faculty, and visitors. My name is Gabriella Mikulvic, and I am running for the student council position of grade 10 rep. Some of you may already know who I am or have seen me in the face, seen me in the school, but most of you have never seen me with my mask off. We all have suffered with our own struggles over the past two years because of COVID-19, and I must say it is such a relief being back in school full time with all of you. COVID-19 has taken away many opportunities and experiences from the students in our school and I'm very happy to see a new normal being formed within the school community. Since I am running for the position of grade 10 rep, I will be focused and committed to any work, projects, or ideas involving my grade. I want to be a familiar face that any grade 10 can approach with questions, ideas, concerns, and criticisms. I want to be able to communicate with you to ensure that we have a great and safe school year together. If you vote for me, I would be honored to be the representative and the voice for the grade 10s at our school. As you are listening to me speaking, you may be wondering, why should I vote for Gabriella Miklovic? Well, let me tell you something. I am a very committed person. When I put my heart and mind to something, I won't give up until I complete my goal. If I am faced with a project or idea, I will do everything I possibly can to complete it. If you have an idea you would like to share to me or to anyone else in the council, I will be your messenger. Do not be afraid to pitch any idea you have to me, as I will never judge them. So everyone, please vote Gabriella Miklovic today, because all it takes is one person, one vote, one opinion to make a difference in our school community. Thank you all for listening. Good luck to my fellow candidates, and I hope you take my speech into consideration when you vote for this year's Grade 10 STM Rep. Thank you. Hey, STM. My name is Alicia Perry, and I want to be your grade 10 representative. I've always made an effort to be a part of the school community, whether that be through sports teams, volunteering, and hopefully student council. By being a part of many teams, I've learned that hard work and teamwork lead to success. I believe I can bring these same characteristics to student council. Since we enter grade 9 under COVID restrictions, we are never able to experience the school spirit that STM is known for, so I'd love the opportunity to help rebuild that through safe social events and hopefully more face-to-face -face interaction. I've always been a creative thinker, which will help me come up with ways to make this school year more enjoyable for everyone. As a grade 10 rep, I promise to be approachable and listen to all of your ideas and opinions. Hopefully together, we can come up with some great ideas to bring up to council. My overall goal as a grade 10 rep is to make the highlight of your day something a lot more exciting than your daily walk around the track. So vote Alicia for your grade 10 rep. Thanks. 
This year, the position for grade 11 rep is also acclaimed. Congratulations, Alice Oper. Next, we will hear from our two candidates running for the position of grade 12 representative. The role of grade 12 representative is to be the voice of their grade level peers. First, we will hear from Sadia Ansari, and next, we will hear from Jane Jowett. Hey STM, I'm Sidia Anwari, and I will be running to become your future grade 12 rep. Seeing that it is our last year here, it would be an honor of representing you and making this year a year you will never forget. I am here to be the voices of this grade, to represent the grade 12s graduating this year. I believe I fit this position because I'm here to bring my ideas and others' ideas to the table to make it more enjoyable at STM every day. I want to put all my time and dedication into this position. To make, to make up for two years worth of events. I want this year to be memorable, enjoyable, and something for all of us to remember. Realistically, I want to be as involved as I can be in St. Thomas More. I want to be able to improve on myself, learn and grow along the way with all my peers. I will try my hardest and best and meet all the expectations of this role and listen to every single idea everyone has. With the factors in this pandemic, it took a huge toll on all of us and has limited so many events for us. And as grade 12 rep, I will be making I get to all the expectations and make sure everything happens this year. Thank you and please vote for City Anwari as your grade 12 rep. Good morning, grade 12. Now, I already know what you're thinking. That's the girl that was on the top of the honor roll list from grade nine to 11, isn't it? <laughs> Well, you're wrong, <laughs> I'm not that girl. But some of you be, may be familiar with me as the girl that uh, took a nice swim on her birthday with her phone in her back pocket. Anyways, uh, my name is Jane Jowett and I'm running for your grade 12 rep. Now, I promise I'll keep this short because of some of you may know, especially the teachers, that I could talk forever. <laughs> this election presents a clear choice. A choice of wanting things the way that they've always been or bringing in someone like me with new, fresh ideas. Aren't you tired of not having fun anymore? Are you tired of repeating the same day over and over? Well, with me as your rep, this is your awakening call. So how can Jane make this year so great and what does she have to offer? I wanna hear all of your ideas so that I can contribute something that you guys are actually interested in to make this year as fun as possible, especially considering that we've had it rough for the past two years. So let me give you some reasons as to why I would make such a good candidate for this position. Well, <laughs> I don't mean to brag or anything, but I am highly experienced since I was on student council before <laughs> in grade six. But that's besides the point. I also happen to be extremely open and approachable, meaning that if you have any questions or concerns, you can always come to me. Allow me to present a few ideas I have in mind. To start off, I have a question for you. Have you ever wondered how athletic your teachers really are? Because I know that I have, and I would love to see them play. So I was thinking of hosting a student versus teachers basketball game. I mean, would you want to see your teacher shoot some hoops? Or maybe have more dances, or you know, you, no uniform day, or pajama day. This is only a small portion of all the ideas I have to make our last year one to remember. So I said I'd keep this short, so I'll close off by saying, you will not regret voting for Jane Jowett as your grade 12 rep. Help me help you. Thank you and have a wonderful day. Thank you. Next we will hear from our candidates running for social convener. For your knowledge, the role of social convener has changed over the years. Our social convener promotes events and disseminates information on social media as well as on Seymour pertaining to any events or activities that student council is running or planning. A social convener is also in charge of finding the entertainment for our dances and proms, and we're hopeful, but who knows, um, and for communicating what the student body would like to see at their social events. So um, we have three candidates running. We will hear from Peace Agata, Rowan Al Shackman, and Ainsley Sheehan. Good morning, STM Knights. My name is Pisa Gata. I'm a grade 12 student at St. Thomas More, and I'm here to be your next social convener for the year of 2022. You may know me from the peer leadership group last year or the cheerleading team from the previous year. 
both of which allowed me to help organize, broadcast, and advertise school events, as well as create school guidelines and enforce COVID safety rules, all while showcasing my amazing school spirit for our amazing school teams. Considering this is my first year running for a student council position, I am so happy to say I couldn't have wished for a better group of students to work with. The last two years have been difficult for all of us, but we've pushed through to be here in person today. As seniors, juniors, sophomores, and freshmen, we have all come so far. And as we've all learned, the life we've become accustomed to today can change overnight. Are you tired of missing out on so many high school experiences? Are you tired of spending your school experiences behind a computer screen? I know I am. And although a lockdown free school year can't be promised, a fulfilling year can be. I promise to fight for spirit weeks, civvies days, and fundraisers for what I hope can be a COVID friendly prom for the seniors and juniors this year. I promise to fight for a COVID friendly semi for the sophomores and work towards a warm and welcoming surprise for the freshmen and newcomers to STM this school year. Vote Peace Agata Social Convener 2022 and let's make this year as bright as our futures. Thank you. Hey STM, my name is Rowan Shackwin and I am running for your 2021-2022 Social Convener. The past three years at STM have been an absolute blast. I've learned many things. For starters, getting involved is the best way to make everlasting memories. I was on the executive committee for We Scare Hunger, and let me tell you, I still get a little stressed every time I hear that Halloween is around the corner. We Scare Hunger had a positive impact on my school year. It taught me multiple skills that fit hand in hand with a role such as social convener. I am more than capable of working together with people as a team, organizing top tier events and putting in 110% in everything I do. After this crazy COVID year that we have had, I will be doing everything in my power to ensure that we have an amazing year filled with COVID friendly events. Being in grade 12 means that it's sadly my last year. And let me tell you, it's gonna be one heck of a year to remember. If you're with me on that note, vote Rowan A all the way for a social convener. Have a great day, STM. I feel like this school year has begun with a collective groan or sigh. Or maybe that's just because I came on screen again and was like, great, it's her again. If you don't know me, my name is Ainsley Shahan. I'm in grade 11 and I am running for the position of social convener. Maybe you don't know me by name, but by one of my many monikers, such as that field hockey girl, or that one prefect who got us all lost. Don't worry guys, I know where I'm going now though, I think. Or finally that girl in your English class who gets overly enthusiastic about essays and speeches. However you may or may not know me, I want to help bring STM closer together this year, but not too close. One way to do this is to host many school events and continue the use of social media apps that we have become so well acquainted with. I know how much I have missed the social aspect of high school, and I'm sure many of you have, you have as well. Actually, like half of you have missed out on that entirely. School should feel like a community. We're all here together with the intention to learn and grow. But how can we possibly do that when we're all too nervous to get out there? With, well, with my help, we can. As I mentioned, I'm very responsible, being able to balance schoolwork, sports, and a social life throughout the years. I'm an excellent leader, as shown through being a prefect here at school or captain of my field hockey team outside of school. Now, I can practically hear the burning question for, through the screen. How are you possibly able to manage all this? Excellent question. Thank you so much for asking. Um, and my answer, why with my excellent organization skills, of course. I make sure to keep track and schedule all my commitments and events throughout the weeks in order for my days to run smoothly. And I can bring that smoothness here to STM. I am, of course, an avid social media user, and I have the skills to manage the social aspect of social convener. I have many great ideas for events this school year, COVID permitting, such as different theme days or weeks, complete dress down days, dances, prom, question mark, fundraisers, school-wide cahoots, games, movies, stress health and relievers during exams, OSSLTs, EQAO, and so much more. I especially want the input of you. Yes, you, in the black shirt. So, don't be afraid to let me know of any great ideas you may have. So become excited with me, STM, because with my help, this school year can be fantastic. Remember to vote for Ainsley Shahan for Social Convener, because it's on the ballot and they couldn't take it off. Thank you. Thank you to all of our candidates. This concludes our speeches. 
The rest is up to you, STM. Get onto your guidance counselor's LMS pages and click the link or follow the directions that Bianca told you this morning where you go to class tools, surveys, and the link will be there too to conduct your voting. Um, the time is now 8.52. Have a great day, STM.